It's your boy Rishonet Cuz. I am your favorite pin fighters, favorite pin fighter thugging it everywhere. Don't believe me? Ask that bitch nigga about me. You dig? Now, why every time you turn around, this nigga whack 100 got somebody dick in his mouth? Like, just take it out. Take it out, blood. Like, you got somebody name in your mouth every, every day. Every day is somebody new with, man. Like, cuz we getting niggas DP'd. Niggas be get it probably got niggas bodied before. You be cop blocking niggas record deal like, like crazy. Like just last week you talking about this poo shicey situation. Like we get it, homie coming home. We thought homie was never coming home. All of a sudden, he coming home and he like he gotta be snitching. Let me go pull up his paperwork. And then you know he's like, uh, 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 I ain't gonna get into the details of the situation. We know this shit fraudulent. He go from that nigga, you beefing with Compton AV, like, trying to pull niggas hood card, like, you beefing with the nigga that's cripping blood. You got that nigga four fades, cuz. All because he said y'all blood niggas be looking like y'all crips. Well, y'all blood niggas be that time looking like y'all crips. We don't be knowing what gang y'all be claiming. Y'all niggas be camouflaged like a motherfucker, like, damn, cuz, like... Now you beefing with Freaky Zeke all over again. You done pulled the, Bo the Bosco, uh, a Crime Stopper old school video with his mama talking about how he witnessed a murder and all this other shit. Like, damn, cuz, like, you a hater. You a hater, hater, hater. Like, I even seen a little little interview with that, that, that little Hoover nigga, that brother killed Pop Smoke. Like, you know. I guess when the associate hit you up and like, how do you feel about this artist? You're like, uh, you ain't really fuck with him. So like, you know, with you having pull in the industry and you you being like, how how should I phrase it? I don't want to even say like a big brother, but like a stepping stone into the right direction. Like, unfortunately on the West Coast, it seems like we gotta go through whack. So it's like, you be you be like. Like you, you, you have a big influence on the decision making on somebody's career. It's like for you to tell somebody, nah, fuck that nigga just because you don't like him. You don't got nothing. You don't, probably don't know what the nigga catalog is like. But that should have stopped, put a stop on whole nigga career. That's some Jay Z shit, my nigga. And then you go through this whole spill, talking about homies ain't do this for you, ain't do that for you, but like. Didn't Birdman put you on? Didn't the Big Slime put you on? Like, nigga, you being weird as fuck, nigga. Like, like I said, you probably got niggas killed just by you running your lip. And even you is gonna be the, the the repercussions of you know whatever that nigga did. Cause you 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 go go back and pull some shit nigga said in 1998. Like, damn, cuz you got a whole nigga G check. Crazy. But. When Nipsey Bodyguard knock you out, you still ain't do shit, but you all in a clown a nigga financial status. That's what, when a bitch nigga get mad, the first thing he want to do is clown or talk about his financial status or his educational level. Like, I went to the most prestige college in America. He, 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 you bitch nigga. You, you the type of nigga that ride walking down on your block. Yeah, you nigga. Crazy. I'm safe where I come from, nigga. But like, whack no honey, like, niggas, niggas like, Niggas don't like you, but it's like niggas gotta respect your business aspect. Like, get it. You got a lot of pull. Like Tupac said, I ain't mad at you. But you 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 do a lot of bitch nigga shit. You do a lot of bitch nigga shit. Like, you like to beef with and you you JT the bigger figure. This nigga then went to Africa, gave up his citizenship, doing all type of dope shit. You beefing with this nigga too. Damn, cuz, you beefing with the righteous nigga. Don't forget that. He got a little pool, cuz. You beefing with your own artist. Your own artist ain't fucking with you, my nigga. Come on, cuz. Come on, blood. What you doing? Now you got niggas like Bosco uh, 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 teaming up with the Inglewoods Pyro on you, cuz. Like your own homie saying, pull up for the fade. Pull up for the fade, what? Bosco don't want to put up for the fade with, with, that, with DW, though. I like Bosco. He's a funny nigga. Plugged him up with Trey D like a year or two ago. You know what I mean? But yeah, I ain't gonna talk him off your head off, man. Shit, man. This nigga whack weirdo, nigga. Tell me what you think about the situation. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share, comment. 
Follow me on Instagram, Relish Renee Cuz, like the Facebook fan page, the Relish Renee Cuz Show. Got a, a new sponsor. I'm about to start advertising. Stay tuned. A lot of dope shit coming your way. Until next time, smoke one for your boy. Thank you.